Welcome back to the next installment of Assassin's Creed 3. Uh, continuing off where we left off. Um, I ran into a glitch. Uh, so in the previous episode, I just turned off the PC and just continued, you know. And then turn it off, you know, reload the save, and then apparently this is a well-known glitch where you've put the third power source in, but it's just not registering, and because of that, there's an original staircase which should be located here, not showing up anymore. So you see how it's blocked off. And then I try to redo the power source thing, and it turns out it's just not registering in general. So I don't know what happened. But apparently you can play on from it, so I'm just going to play on. Home stretch, Desmond. I can feel it. The tides of war are turning. The Loyalists fall back beneath the advancing Patriot army, their hold on this land weakening by the day. But the Templars only seem to grow stronger. Though fewer in number, the threat they pose appears undiminished. Making matters worse, Washington chose to spare the life of Charles Lee. I am told he has taken refuge inside Fort George, and so my days are spent searching for a way to breach its walls. Of my father, there is no trace, and I am glad of it. If I can be rid of Lee, there may still be a chance for reconciliation, and through it, peace. Connor, he's asking for you. Hello, Connor. <gasps> Come now. Your sadness won't sustain me any more than that fool woman's soups and potions. Tell me of your latest exploits. Charles Lee has been exposed, and the Patriots finally rid of him. They march now to secure the remaining cities that this country might finally be free. Then you have won. The land and your people are safe. Yet you seem troubled. Washington spared Lee's life. So long as he lives... All are in danger. The same is true for your father. When you first came to me, you understood what had to be done. Swore you'd see it through. If not for the Brotherhood, for your people, and all those threatened by the Templars. But with Lee gone, my father might... Listen to me. You have not come this far to throw it all away over misplaced sentiment. Both men must die. A Achilles. There is nothing more to discuss. Connor, I came as soon as I could. Tell me you bring good news. The Comte de Grasse said yes. You need only join his fleet in Chesapeake Bay and they will serve as required. But what exactly is it you intend? It's better that I show you. Charles Lee may have been dismissed. But it does not mean we are safe. But the commander? The commander underestimates the threat, and no more time can be wasted trying to convince him otherwise. I must do this on my own. Do what, exactly? Kill Charles Lee. He hides within Fort George, which is itself surrounded by a militarized district. I cannot hope to infiltrate it directly. So I will go under instead. Incroyable. The tunnels leading to the fort have been filled in. While I secure the Admiral's ships, I need you to clear them for me. And the ships? When signaled, they will bombard the fort. 
Breaching its walls and creating a distraction, I see. In the chaos, I will slip inside, find Charles Lee, and silence him forever. I knew it was that easy. Um, should I change my costume? I don't know how to get down. Yeah. Yeah. The fuck? Okay, I don't know. Yes, not changing question. Exit. Continue on with the mission. Hopefully, the glitch doesn't mess up the save. Oh, that's my horse. It's inside the house. God fucking damn. Here we go. Thank God. Thank God for that. Alrighty. Uh... This shit. Oh. Yes. I wonder how glitched this save file is. Fuck. If I had promised me a fleet beyond compare and a captain without fear, instead, I find myself greeted by one old ship in a boy in costume. I promise we are all you need, Admiral. I doubt this very much, but beggars do not choose. Mm -hmm. And the ships I require? They are yours, provided we survive this. Well, what would you have me do? Hold the bay while I engage the main fleet. Should any British ships dare approach, destroy them. They must be kept from Yorktown. Ah. <sighs> Only using only destroy ships only using one board side. What does that mean? Don't do that.
Oh, oh, that's not good. Don't hit me. Cute. Nicely damaged. Damn it! Turned away! Oh, I got him. Well, someone else got him. Alright, uh, that it? Yo, man, I'm running out of health. I have no health. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dude. I've taken so many unnecessary damage. But I'm back up. Holes. Goddamn lucky. How did you miss that? Now just Oh no. Bring it! Multiple! 
Can you please just... Jesus. Dude, I'm getting damaged because I'm freaking running into my own teammate's ship. Aha! That's how you do it. Uh, to be fair, I wasn't even looking at him. Oh, fucking reload quicker! It's Dude, this is not looking too good. Ah, oh my god, it sucks. Let's do this again. Did not shoot? Fucking way through that. Change course, sir. Wind's in our face. That's all right. Watch this. Bullshit. One down. Come on. Come on. Come on. any way to um it's that one Is there any way to upgrade your ship to have fucking cans on both sides? Kill him.
Thank God I missed. They're reloading so much quicker than we are. Oh god, dude, we're dying. This, did you just run into a ship? I'm in the circle. Come on. Careful, Captain. On the port! Port side, Captain! Man of Get more in range! Come on. Far out. Oh, that's fire. No. Oh, God.
They say you took down that man of war all alone. Perhaps Lafayette did not exaggerate when he spoke of your abilities. As promised, my ships are yours to command. What do you require? Five of them must enter New York's harbor flying British flags. Wait, wait. I thought you might need some pirates killed or goods transported, and instead, you asked for us to... What, shell New York? No. Of course not. Ah. Only part of it. Explain yourself. I mean to infiltrate Fort George, but it is too well guarded. Cannon fire will breach its walls and scatter its guards. And a ship that flies the French flag could never get near it. You understand, then? Not at all. But a promise is a promise, even when made to a lunatic. I will light a signal fire when it is time for you to attack. Vous l'avez entendu. Récupérez leurs drapeaux qu'on puisse les accrocher. Allez, vite! Loading out there. Fast kill. All right, let's go kill Charles Lee. Or not? Hello, Gunner. Welcome back. Is everything in place? We oui. Lafayette waits for you inside the tunnel beneath the city. West District disputed. All right. Anyway, uh, let's get to the mission. Far away is it? Get out of my way, honks. I wonder if the next Assassin's Creed or I want to say it's black flag, just as difficult and glitchy. Difficult in terms of difficult to just endure. <laughs> Alright, I'm here. Go! I feel like we're just fast travel there to be quite honest. Bloody hell. Nice, yeah, it's not already pre... Pre-explore these. take you into the military district and the admiral he waits for you to light the signal and then the strike begins and we will be there as well <laughs> me cleave off get out
a clear shot. That was very close. I ain't got a minute, bro. Fuck. You. Stop there. I'm not here. Get back here. I've got a clear shot. Taking me with someone else. Climb up. I've seen you jump higher. My God. Price. mission here we go where are you Charles gone come now you cannot out to match me Connor ah! your skills you are still but a boy with ah! so much left to learn ah! Missed and censured. He can do nothing for you now. A temporary setback. He will be restored. Uh, you act as though you have some right to judge. Uh, you declare me and mine wrong for the world. Okay. And yet every we did not harm your people. We did not support a crown. We worked to see this land united and at peace. Under our rule, all would be equal. Do the patriots promise the same? I will spare you. Brave words. 
man about to die. You fare no better. Even when your kind appears to triumph, still we rise again. And do you know why? It's because the Order is born of a realization. We require no creed, no indoctrination by desperate old men. All we need is that the world be as it is. This is why the Templars will never be destroyed. Don't think I have any intention of caressing your cheek and saying I was wrong. I will not weep and wonder what might have been. I'm sure you understand. Still, I'm proud of you in a way. You have shown great conviction, strength, courage. All noble qualities. I should have killed you long ago. On a giwa here, I can get. We've got a problem. Hatham doesn't have the amulet anymore. But the temple's still sending data. There must be more to the story. <sighs> Only one way to find out. Okay, done and done. Somehow I was undetected, which is cool. Nice. My father is dead. Charles Lee now leads the Templar Order in his place. I see now why ours is an eternal war. For each piece taken from the board, another is placed upon it. Back and forth we go. Across the world. Across the ages. Some days mine feels an impossible task. But I cannot afford to be consumed with doubt. The people need me. Now more than ever. I must stop the Templars. I will kill Charles Lee. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to call it here. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode and I will see you guys next time.